Jim family. My story began at a very young age. Um, I'm from Puerto Rico. I have Puerto Rican accent. My father is in the military. And Jacksonville was a deployment that he had. We moved here. I was six years old. And it was a very difficult transition. I barely spoke English. And it was difficult. Uh, we were here for, well, I was here for six months. My sisters and I were sent back to Puerto Rico because we weren't, weren't able to cope. And at that point, we celebrate food as a Latin community. We celebrate everything with food. <laughs> so I associated food with happiness. And whenever I was going through, I would eat. Um, and it followed me through my teenage years, my adulthood. And I did try several, I did try several diets. Keyword diets. Um, I did, as a teenager, I did a life. It didn't agree with me. And I say it for other people, but it did not agree with me. It actually hospitalized me for a week. Um, I did Jenny Craig, which my older sister provided for me because she saw what I was going through. And what I did with that is, these portions are ridiculous. I ate that, and I ate food. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was the miracle pill, Fintermin. Uh -huh. I did that, lost 100 pounds, went through something, gained the 100 plus, and plus some, just gained a lot of weight. I was in college and I was working at Convergence and the Biggest Loser came. So they wanted to have a Biggest Loser competition. And I said, I'm going to do this. Well, everybody was getting weighed in the general area. They had to take me to the mail room and weigh me on the time machine. And we love you. That, that did not wake me up. I just ate more and gained more weight. Um, I decided, and, and, but one thing I always said was, I'm a big woman, but I don't have any illnesses. Thank God for that. Um, I then decided I was going to do Weight Watchers when Jennifer Hudson came out, looking fabulous and skinny. <laughs> and I did start losing weight, and in 2011, I suffered a miscarriage. And I started gaining weight again because I ate. In the summer of 2012, I'm a Facebook fanatic. I see postings of Body by Body. No one had approached me, but I was watching people that I had gone to high school with that I guess were promoters because they were posting Body by Body, Body by Body. And then I did have a high school friend contact me and ask me if I would host a challenge party in my home which I did, and I had a few people over. Uh, I, I ordered from him, and then I canceled my order and became a Trump customer. <laughs> so what I, what I mean by that is whenever I wanted a bag, which by the way, I was putting away in my pantry, um, I would call him and say, hey, I need a bag. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, um, yeah. I was invited to another challenge party, and Charlotte Spencer and Derek Smalls were the featured speakers. And I got, I got, I got the challenge, and I got the business part portion of it. Still wasn't ready. I did um, sign up, but at that point I was also suffering headaches and sweats, and I was fatigued. And oh, I'm a nurse by profession. And I found out that I have high blood pressure. So I still wasn't doing anything. December 14th, I woke up in the middle of the night and I said, Veronica, you're going to be 40 years old in two years. What do you have to show for it? I want to be fit. That's right. I want to be financially free. I don't want to have to depend 
people, you know, a lot of my family. I want them to be able to depend on me. And on the 16th, I went and joined LA Fitness. Came home, signed up on the challenge. I challenged myself to 60 pounds. At the completion of my first 90 day challenge, I lost 83 pounds. <laughs> You know, I was at the gym, I was tired, I, I didn't want to push through the reps, but I did. When I didn't want to go to the gym, I would jump on Facebook and I would see postings from you. Yeah. yeah. You know, motivational postings. Derek going to the gym. <laughs> David at the gym. You show me pictures that you're at the gym doing something, let me go to the gym. Um, and. It's just, it's transformed my life from the inside out. As you, as, as I've lost the weight, I've become lighter so I can hear God better. And one thing I would say about all those other things that I tried that makes body of my different is the tools and the support system. Amen. Yeah, amen. This is a family. Yeah. Yes. And we lean on one another. That's right. So now I lean on my family when I'm having a difficult moment. I jump on Facebook. I make a phone call. I forget the scale. Come on now. Yeah. Because what you have to realize, let the mirror talk to you. Yeah. Okay. Every small accomplishment is an achievement. Yes. Every little thing that you notice is an achievement. And you have to understand that you're you are now giving your body something that it had never had. So it fights against you sometimes. But if you push through, you will persevere and succeed. Yeah. Right now, I'm in my third challenge, and I'm down 149 pounds. Woo! And I will be the next live female transformation.